John Bennett was a girl who was born on August 6, 1919 in Atlanta, Georgia. One year after she was born, she moved with her family to Boulder, Colorado. The girl was well known because she participated in beauty pageants and won hundreds of pageants. Her mother was also well known in the ranks 1977. She won the rank of Miss West Virginia. On the morning of December 26, in 1996, the 911 line receives a call where her mother confirms that her daughter has been stolen and that he left a note asking for a reward. 911 emergency. Oh, we need him. Police. What's going on? 515 Street. What's going on there, ma'am? We have a kidnapping. Oh my God. Please. Take a deep breath. Please, okay. hurry, hurry, hurry. Patty? Patty? The call was made by John Bennett's mother, who got up at 5 a.m. to drink water. As soon as she went downstairs, she found a note saying that her daughter had been kidnapped. The note said they needed 108,000 to rescue the girl, but not call the police because if they did, they would kill the girl. Some time later, the police arrived and asked to the father to check the house again in case she was somewhere. The father hurried to the basement where they found John Bennett's lifeless body with a blanket over it. At the time it was found, that girl had a rope tied around her neck, another zip tied over her mouth, and a fracture in her skull. The main suspects were the mother, father, and his brother. When she called the police, she said she was alone, but this was not true because other voices were heard. In an interview, they read their body language and it is saying that they lie. Fully convinced that your daughter was kidnapped by some outsiders outside your family or circle of friends? Yes. Shaking her head no. It's just so hard to know. Shaking her head no, and then when John says yes, she changes her head to a nod. Benita was six years old and her brother Nan, and he embraced her because all attention was always for her. He had two marks on his ribs from a blow from his brother's toys.